hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm explaining about sudan who was the last non-male northern white rhinoceros he was born in 1973 and date on 19th march 2018 he was living at Dwar Karlov Zoo in Czech Republic from 1975 to 2009. In 2009, he was moved to Old Pejeta Conservancy in Lekipia, Kenya. At the time of his death, he was one of the only three living northern white rhinoceros in the world and the last non male of his subspecies. Sudan was in Antoinette on 19th March 2018 after suffering from age related complications because it's um, he, he was he died at uh, at the age of 45 which is almost equal to 90 years in human life a group of six northern white rhinoceros including the two year old Sudan was captured in Shampe Sudan by animal trappers employed by Chipperfield Circus in February 1975, working under an agreement with Joseph Wagner, the then director of Dorkarlov Zoo in Czechoslovakia, which is now Czech Republic. The captured group compromised two males, Sudan and Sot, and four females, Nola, Nuri, Nadi, and Nesari. The number of northern white rhinos was already considered to be only around 700 animals in the wild for many environmentalists. Leaving the animals in nature was the only acceptable way of preserving the already rare species. The Tur Karlov Zoo and their Chipperfield partner were then criticized for the capture. The zoo was specializing in African fauna and already had their largest collection out of Africa. Life in Czech Republic Sudan, in 1975, the group including Sudan was shipped to the Dor Karlov Zoo for their northern white rhinoceros display. The zoo was the only one in the world where northern white rhinos have successfully given birth with the last calf being born in 2000. Two years later they were joined by Nasima who was originated from Uganda but came from Nosley Safari Park near Prescott and Sot was later lent to San Diego Zoo in the United States. After 1980, the northern white rhinos were wiped out in Uganda and Sudan and 13 were left in Garamba National Park in Zaire, which is Congo now. The conservation breeding specialist group of the IUCN met in 1986 in Dor Karlov Zoo to discuss the ways to preserve the dwindling number of northern white rhinos. The efforts to save the subspecies include the import of Ben, an older male from London, in 1986 and the return of sort a cough from the original 1975 group from San Diego Zoo in 1998 to Dur Kralov Zoo. Attempts to join the group with several southern rhinos met only with a mixed success. Several surgeries were performed on the females and their eggs genetic materials including Sudan semen was preserved. Offspring Sudan fathered three calves in the Czech Republic and because became the grandfather of one. Sudan fathered Nabir uh, who was born 15 November 1983 and died at uh, Dorkarlov in July 2015. He was also the father of Nejin, who was transported to Old Pejeta Conservancy along with him in 2009. Nejin was born in 1989 again, again with the dam being Nesima. Sudan has also said one of the offsprings beside Nebir and Nejin. The third calf was born prematurely and died. Sudan was the grandfather of Fatu through his daughter Nejin. For breeding, Sudan's stud book number was 0372. Breeding crisis. The Durkarlov rhinos were getting older and after 2000 no more calves were being born around the world. The second to last male northern white rhinos in the world was Ankalifu, who lived in the San Diego Zoo Safari Park with Nola until his death on 14 December 2014. Ankalifu was beyond breeding age, leaving Sudan as the only fertile male in the world even after even when Angalifu was alive. In June 2008, specialists met in 
Dorkar Lov Zoo to decide further steps to save suspects. The meeting of the Czech Zoo with the IUCN, African Rhino Specialist Group, World Zoo Aquarium Association, Berlin Institute of IZW, as well as experts from Vienna Veterinary Institute and the European Zoo and Aquarium Association. Are recommended to move Sudan and his group from the Czech Republic to Africa. Substantial debate succeeded. The strong objections were raised against the pro proposal, especially given the fact that expect experts and scientific organizations were available in Europe and insemination efforts could have continued in the Czech Republic. But he returned to Kenya in December 2009 to all Pejeta Conservancy for last chance to survive breeding program. Along with the three other northern white rhinoceros, it was hoped that Olpejeta would provide a more natural habitat and better hormonal balance for the animals to induce breeding. However, the breeding attempts with Sudan at Olpejeta Conservancy were unsuccessful. One of the other three rhinos transported to Olpejeta Conservancy, Sunia died in 2014. Sudan then lived the final years of his life with his daughter Najin and granddaughter Fatu. Northern white rhinoceros are guarded 24 hours a day at the Conservancy to protect them from poaching, which is a major problem for rhinoceros. The protection includes horn embedded transmitters, watchtowers, fences, drones, guard dogs, and trained armed guards around the clock. At, death, at the end of 2017, Sudan suffered from infection of his right hind leg. Although his condition improved in subsequent months, the infection returned, and in March 2008, his state seriously deteriorated despite intensive care. Sudan was euthanized on 19th March 2018 after suffering from age related complications. In the week before Sudan's death, Richard Vigne, CEO of the Old Pejeta Conservancy, stated that Sudan has been technically infertile for many years, so him dying is not going to affect the possibility of recovery for the northern white rhino as species. Thank you for watching, guys. I believe this video was helpful to you. Subscribe the channel, click the bell icon for notification. Take care. Goodbye.